What is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I gotta share with you a burger that has taken over my brain that I can't quit thinking about and I've eaten literally three times in the last four days. And that is an Oklahoma onion burger. You might see it all over YouTube. It's kind of trending lately. And after watching a couple videos, I was like, you know what? I bet we can make that higher in protein, lower in calories, still just delicious while still making it fit into our diet while we're losing weight. So in today's video, we're gonna make an anabolic onion burger that I promise you is even better than it looks. Packs in a whopping 84 four grams of protein, and it's so easy to make, even a caveman could do it. If you're tired of the burgers you've been eating not doing your body any good and leaving you feeling like a bloated mess, then look no further than this video, because I'm telling you, it just might change your life. All right, ladies and gentlemen, if y'all are ready their epic video underway, then as always, man, I'm here to do it for you. Let's do it! Yeah! All right, ladies and gents, making healthy and delicious burgers at home isn't complicated. We just got a few little things we gotta do. First off, we need to choose the right bun. I use Nature's Own Butter Buns. I think they got the best flavor while still only having 140 calories. And every good sandwich needs a buttered and toasted bun. So we'll flip this over and instead of adding butter with a ton of calories, instead we're gonna use, I can't believe it's not butter spray. Zero calories, tons of butter flavor. What more could you want? I'm just gonna lightly spray both sides. And now we'll just pop these in a skillet, set to medium heat, let them do their thing for a few minutes till they're golden brown and just how we want. And look at that perfection. Golden brown, butter flavor baked in, literally the ultimate burger hack. Now, moving on to the meat, what we have here is 96% lean ground beef. We have a 336 grams of it. And if you're trying to make a healthier, high protein, lower calorie burger, this is the only percentage you should use. When it comes to seasonings, we're gonna keep it simple. About two grams of kosher salt, followed up by a gram of black pepper. Now I'm just gonna go in by hand, mix everything together. Then I'll just split this pile in half. Then we'll go ahead and start forming it into a patty. And if you want this to cook optimally, the thinner the better. Once we got it shaped up, sit on a cutting board, then I'm gonna go ahead and get this other one patted up real quick. So now that we got these burgers patted up, we're gonna set them off the side and we're gonna move into the most important component of this burger, which is the onion. Now we gotta do a couple tips and tricks to get this how we want it, but don't worry. I'm gonna make it easy and show you all the secrets. And keep in mind, if you like the idea of eating foods just like this one, pizzas, burgers, chicken wings, donuts, chocolate chip cookies, ETC, yet you want those to be able to work for your body, help you lose weight, build muscle, get in a ton of protein, don't forget, every recipe from the channel, over 320 of them are available in my cookbook. Not only does this thing get updated every time I drop a new recipe, just like this one, I guarantee that as long as you follow what's in here, you will see results no matter what. The best diet is the one that doesn't even feel like a diet, it feels like a lifestyle. And with this in your pocket, you'll be eating good and losing weight all at the same time. If that sounds good to you, hit the link in my description box to check it out. Now what I have here that I highly recommend is a vegetable slicer I bought on Amazon for like 18 bucks. This thing is invaluable. We're gonna run our onion through this to get super thin sliced onions, but first we gotta do some maintenance on this bad boy. All we're gonna do is take our onion, by the way, I recommend you get the smallest one you can find. We're gonna chop off the ends just like like that. Then we're gonna go in and peel off this outer layer. And then now I'm just gonna cut it into quarters. Boom and boom. And now these are ready to thin slice in our vegetable peeler. I have the spiralizer attachment in here. I'm just gonna go in, make sure you put on a glove so you don't get cut. Then we're just gonna twist this in here right on this blade. And every time we do it, it's gonna thin slice our onion and make them perfect for this onion burger. And check out the end result, guys. We now have 56 grams of very thin sliced onions, just how we want them. And these are gonna be perfect for this burger. Now we need to lay out the final ingredients, which which is a crucial step when you're cooking. I always recommend burgers, anything on an open skillet, have everything laid and measured out. That way you're not scrambling last minute and something gets burnt. The number one key to cooking good, delicious food is paying attention. You've been warned, buddy. So we literally have everything right here. We got the two burgers, we got the toasted bun waiting in the wings, we got our onions, and the final thing we need is two slices of fat-free American cheese. Now, let's make some magic happen. Preheat your skillet, medium high heat, little non-stick, and now we'll just give these burgers a quick fry. And now, after letting these cook for a few minutes, we're take our onions and spread them all over the top of our burger. We can let some kind of fall off, no big deal. We just wanna make sure we get full coverage. And what this will do is some of these when we flip it are gonna get nice and caramelized, some will just be steamed, and overall this creates one heck of a burger. Some might even call it a certified hood classic. And now I'm just gonna take a burger press, I'm gonna press down, lock some of those onions down in there, we'll do the same to the other one, and then once the underside's done, we'll go ahead and flip, boom, and then a couple minutes before they finish, we'll place our cheese right on top, let it melt, and then once these are looking good, we'll pull them off and it'll be time to feast. See you guys in a second. All 
All right, folks, time for this to all come together. We'll start with our first patty, lay it right down on here. Then we'll take some of the extra onions from the skillet, place them on top of the cheese. Then we'll place our other patty on top, followed up by any of our leftover onions in the pan. And then finally, we put on the top bun. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the anabolic onion burger. And check it out, guys. In no time at all, we've made a delicious onion burger that's not only easy to make, but it's loaded down with protein and we can fit it right into our diet. Like I always preach, there's no reason we can't eat burgers on a diet, we just gotta eat the right ones. And with this one, we definitely made the right choice. Now, before this guy gets cold, I think it's time to strap on the old feed bag and try this thing together. If you guys are ready, then I am too. Let's go. All right, folks, now before we hop into this, you already know, we give away a box of the best tasting protein bar in the world, the Anabar, in every single video. In order to enter the giveaway, all you gotta do on this video is hit that thumbs up button, be subscribed to the channel, and leave a comment down below. I choose a random winner and announce it in every single video. And the winner from the last one is XYA Parashar with the comment. Thank you so much, Remington. I'm down 60 pounds. The cookbook has made my life so much easier. I've struggled with losing weight for the longest time, and little did I know it was possible to have all the food I've been craving. That is still crazy to me. Thank you for being such an inspiration. Hey, Parashar, uh, first off, congrats on the 60 pounds. That is massive. Seriously, if you look at statistics on people that try to lose weight, more often than not, people will initially lose like 10 or 15 pounds, but they almost always end up gaining it back. The statistics aren't the best, and I think that's because people inherently are doing stuff they don't enjoy. So the fact that you enjoy it, it still blows your mind that you can eat these foods and lose weight. That is the whole goal of this thing. I always say, and it sounds maybe a little hyperbolic, but this quite literally changed my life when I say I wanted to change yours. I mean that, and it seems like you're letting the diet do its thing. So appreciate you. Keep on pushing. Email Email me in my description box. I'll get one of these out to you ASAP for everybody else. If you want to try the world's best tasting protein bar, we are now available in HEB nationwide and we keep selling out, which is phenomenal to me and I wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. So if you are in Texas and you have an HEB near you, if you stop in, even if you just get one bar, it would mean the absolute world to me. We're going up against heavy hitters like Quest, Fit Crunch, RX Bar, all these big corporations and we're just a couple guys trying to do something. So yeah, that uh, means the world to me, seriously. And if you're not in Texas, we're available on Trader Joe's. You can also go to theanabar.com. My code RGF10 will save you Money and I promise you'll be getting the only protein bar that actually tastes like a candy bar. Thank you to everybody for all the support. Make sure you enter that giveaway, people. All right, now let's take a look at this delicious burger. Mm, mm, mm. You can't tell me that guy right there doesn't look incredible. Moment of truth, people. Three, two, one, let's get it. Wow. Now I know this was a relatively simple recipe, right? We didn't have a ton of ingredients here, but those onions, the caramelized onions, the ones that get steamed while you're cooking it, really bring out a ton of flavor in this thing. I can't even begin to explain it. It's something you gotta try. It's like, look at all those onions on there. Hopefully you can see those. The way they cook under the meat brings out so much flavor, it makes this thing phenomenal. Mm. Oh my gosh, guys, if you like onions and you like burgers, this one right here, you have to try. I wasn't lying when I said I've been eating this thing, like literally the past four days, I've had it three times, and I swear every time it just keeps getting better. And the best part is when I bring the nutrition is the amount of protein we get, it's gonna blow your mind. Now in this burger, if you made it exactly how I did it, which end up with for the whole thing is just 591 calories with only 15 grams of fat, a whopping 84 grams of protein with just 30 grams of carbs with zero grams of fiber. Now in a big, double, cheesy burger like this, only being 591 calories is pretty nuts. And on top of that, over half of those calories come from the protein with 84 grams. That is insane. But you can see though, when we use the right ingredients, right? You choose the right bun, use the right lean beef, use the right cheeses with more protein. All that stuff adds up, helps us get closer and closer to our protein goal. You guys know what I say. The only two things that matter when you're trying to lose weight are A, are you eating enough protein? For most men, you want at least 200 grams a day. For most women, I would say around 130 grams a day. Those are ballpark numbers, but for most people, they should be applicable. And then secondly, we just gotta eat those right amount of calories. When you prioritize those two things, the results happen no matter what. When you're eating food like this that you actually enjoy with that much protein, it makes hitting your protein goal something you don't even gotta think about when you're eating recipes like this, and all you gotta focus on is calories. That has overly simplified my dieting life. It's made living lean, being comfortable in my own skin so much easier, and ultimately, the number one way to ensure your success is to find the easiest way to get to the end result. And for me, eating foods I love while still losing weight and enjoying what I'm doing is a no-brainer. But seriously, guys, I know if you make this, you will absolutely love it. If you decide to, take a Pretty picture and tag me, whatever is your social, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I even have a TikTok. You can find me on there and let me know what you think. And as always, if you have a copy of the RGF Anabolic Cookbook, it has been updated, so go get the newest copy. Like I said earlier, we got every recipe from the channel in here, from dessert to pizza to donuts to chocolate chip waffles. Quite literally, if you have a favorite food, it's most likely in this book, and it grows every time I drop a new video. If you want to follow the best diet in the world, where it becomes more of a lifestyle, where you're eating foods you actually enjoy while still losing weight, you may want to check this out. Hit that link in my description. I know if you do and you follow us 
what's in this book you really do, you'll see results no matter what. And all right, folks, that is gonna wrap up this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed yourself today. As always, if you ever like the clothes I'm wearing, Young LA blue cutoff tee. That way you don't gotta mess around with ruining shirts. And I got on some of their athletic shorts right here. I love these ones, they're a little higher. And I like them that way. We got the cool branding right here on the string. It's got a little removable pouch. Look at this. Look at that, you can take that off right there. And my favorite part on these is these zippers. You can zip your pocket up and you even got a wallet pocket. Young LA is quite literally all I wear. It's basically all my girlfriend wears these days. And whether you're man, woman, child, non-binary, they definitely got something for you. So younglay.com, my code RGF saves you money and I promise if you try it out, you're gonna end up loving it just as much as I do. And if you like the sound of this diet and you would want me to make you a meal plan where I break down how many calories you need in a day based on a questionnaire you fill out that gives me your height, weight, age, food preferences, basically all your info so I can dial in a program perfectly for you, you can check out my website, remedyjamesfitness.com. We can get that handled. You wanna get those results? I can get them to you. You just gotta do it. And with that, we are out of here, folks. I appreciate each and every one of you as always. Go make yourself an onion burger. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, I'll see every one of you at the next video. See you guys. Boom, 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 baby. We gone. Mmm, wow, that's good.